This should do it. How about this? Unbelievable! Remarkable! Anyway... Thank you ever so much. A breakthrough! Our research has borne new fruit! No, no! Remarkable! How about this? Please take a look. Please take care of it. My thanks. And another thing. <sighs> Is that so? Very well. That's a huge help. Putting that aside... <laughs> I hope you'll come again. Got a sec? Got a sec? Well done. <laughs> uh, oh, bother. Uh, oh, damn it all. about my thanks <laughs> I listen oh no anyway I understand
Our mission is... A tiresome task. But Commander, remember it is vital that we accept requests from the public if we are to keep up appearances. Our status as mercenaries makes us better suited than any knightly order to accommodate Duke Hende's needs. Oh, very well. Now, on to the details of this mission. The request hails from the village of Biltar in North Central Field. They report that a number of their young women have been kidnapped. It seems they have been forced into Count Horace's brothel, and it is our task to get them out. If the Count were revealed to be a kidnapper, it would be a real blow to Lord Kimball's faction. Not to mention that stifling a rival councillor's revenue would be a great boon to Duke Hende, I'm sure. Yes, I'm sure. But we cannot just march into a noble's territory on the word of some villager. The Count would simply feign complete ignorance, and then we would be the ones left with egg on our faces. I have a plan. Walter Quinn, if you would. I was able to secure a private audience with Lord Kimball, posing as a well-intentioned informant. What? After the initial pleasantries, we were soon discussing serious matters. I mentioned Count Horace's sordid occupation, and may have suggested that Duke Hende was sniffing around. This panicked our dear Lord Kimball to no end. He ordered that Count Horace be killed without delay. He'd assassinate a nobleman from his own faction. The noble Lord Kimball is no doubt attempting to tie up any loose ends before Duke Hende gets further involved. Here is Count Horace's assassination order, signed by Lord Kimball himself. It is our reason for visiting Biltar. With this, no one would dare question us. What? Hmm. Commander Jordan? Now do as you see fit. Count Horace's domain, Biltar, is not far from here. It shouldn't take more than half a day on horseback. We should set off at once. I fear for the safety of those women. Snap out of your stoop already. There's a band of mercenaries coming for your head as we speak. How could this happen to me? Lord Kimball, why? You were found out by an enemy faction. Are you so surprised that he cut you loose? Well, that's enough, Haddy. I will take the fight to them, and you'll join me. I'd rather not get involved, to be honest. But I suppose you can have a few of my men. The enemy looks willing to fight to the death. What's our plan for breaking through? It doesn't look like they had much time to prepare for us. Oh my, I didn't think you were one for fireworks. Oh, it's simply the most logical choice, given the circumstances. I couldn't agree more. Now. Shall we? Understood. I've got it. Another one down! Victory! 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 Victory
Understood. Next time. Push forward. Very well. Me down. To Alate. On my way. Go. Capture successful. The bridge is down. And the enemy is ready to give us a warm welcome. What do you make of this, Andreas? The narrow point of access limits how many we'll need to face at once. It's to our advantage. How reassuring. That's my reckoning, too. On my way. Right away. Understood. Enemy down. To Alatane. Very well. On my way. Next target. Understood. I won't miss. I understand. Next target. To Alatane. On my way. We've taken control. It won't be pretty if we get surrounded. What's your take on the situation, Rias? Archers and magickers are powerful from a distance, but vulnerable at close range. We should take them out first and create a gap in the enemy ranks. Yes, that would be my strategy too. Understood. Understood. 
Understood. I've got it. Oh, what have we here? Very well. We've taken control. Horus must be running out of minions to hide behind. What was that? It seems they're willing to try anything in order to stop us. What do you think, Riaz? It's a simple, dull-witted creature. We can defeat it. <laughs> Nothing phases you, does it? Push 
I won't miss. On my way. Here it goes. Very well. Did I overdo it? Fall into ranks. Form a magic ritual. An attack. I'm messing around. Understood. And in position. Fire. Take you down. <clears throat> Next target. I've got it. I can barely stand. Understood. Fall into ranks. I will perform a magical ritual. We'll hold them here. Understood. You call that an attack? On my way. Don't let it happen again. Oh, thanks. It was about time. It would seem I've grown stronger.
Things will end badly for us all if the cell swords have their way. So they'd best be taken out sooner rather than later. Your groundwork made for a successful mission, Walter Quinn. <laughs> Indeed it did. Eliminating Horace was a simple matter, and all the women came away unharmed. I would gladly do the same again. Though I never imagined my upbringing would lead me to this. <laughs> never have I met a woman quite as mysterious as that one. Well, whatever she's hiding, it's no concern of ours. Not for now, at least. You know, you're quite the mystery yourself, Andreas. Oh, yes. Andreas is always holding something back, my dear Iscarion. That's certainly something I've come to realize. <laughs>